Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I did a wig review for Uni's hair. And I feel really good because this hair got me feeling really good. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, I did, a, I took a few clips. I'm going to put it in here. I showed y'all how I made the top flat. How I straightened the hair. But when the hair was straightened, I'm going to show y'all that the ends was really puffy. It wasn't really, really puffy, but... It was, I don't know how to explain it, but y'all gonna see it in the video. But it's fine right now. Ever since I curled it, it's fine. Um, it curled really well. For some reason, if the hair of the ends is not really, if I see a lot of flyaways, I just end up curling the hair. That's why y'all see me in body wave a lot. Um, so the lace was amazing. It took me 2.5 to lay some baby hairs, even though the baby hairs aren't even. I have a problem with trying to lay my left baby hairs than my right baby hairs, but... At the end of the day, it came out fire. Okay, guys, so this is the clip that I was talking about. Uni's hair, that's the box that it came in. It just fell, you know, I'm just going to leave it on the floor. So this is how the hair looks when it first came, you know, looking all crazy and everything. That's why I'm here, you know, to fix the hair up. So right here, I'm just running my fingers through it, testing it out, seeing what's up with it. And every time I get a wig, the first thing I do is try to make the front flat. So as you can see right here, I'm using my hot comb. I didn't pluck yet. I'm just trying to see what's up with it, what I could do, you know. Right here, I'm plucking it. So after you finish plucking it, you just want to make sure that it's as flat as possible so that you can get your baby hairs going. Your hair have to be flat, okay? So as you can tell, I did pluck a lot, but it's okay because, like, you know, it's going to look like scalp once I put that NW58 on it. But I did a good job. Like, you can't tell me I didn't do a good job. So you get that NW58. Make sure that it's your shade and your color skin so the lace could blend right in. That's what I do all the time. And that's how my wigs be looking like it's mine. So I did a little trick over here. I got some mascara and I put it right on top of the NW58 so that the NW58 could look like my scalp. And then the mascara could still look like the hair is coming from my scalp. <laughs> so this is the finished results. That's how it came out. And I loved it. All I had to do was cut the lace off and put my wig on. But the ends was blowing mine. Like, look at these ends. So to avoid these ends, I still don't know how to, but for now on, I just curl my hair and, you know, just make it work. So the type of curls that I'm doing is the ones that drop, and when it drops, it still gives you that type of vibe that your hair is still curled, and it's still pretty. It's not those type of curls that when the curl drops, your hair is all wavy looking, and it just looks like you did a bad job. So these curls, they're going to sit for a few hours, and then they're going to drop, and then it's going to look marvelous. So we're going to talk about the hair real quick. Like I said, it is from Uni's hair. So the hair details. It was a 613 lace front tool. It was 150 density. I love 150 density because it's not too full. I hate full hair in the summertime. That should be all on my back, man, sweaty and shit. Like, that gets me so tight. Like, I'm so happy it's 150 density. Um, 26 inches. I thought it was 24 inches, but it's 26 inches. I guess in the video that I did, I'm going to show y'all, it was long. I guess. I don't know, but it looked like 24 inches. Um, Yeah, 150 density. Everything's going to be down below. Um, So there is a little bit shredding, but that's okay. Hair shreds. But this hair is bomb. Like, it's fire. Like, it moves when I move. Like, look. It moves when I move. Like... Like, the curls drop, but it didn't really drop all the way. As long as this soup is right here, I'm okay. Like, I'm not going to recurl my hair. If y'all have any questions, so the baby hairs. I didn't get the baby hairs on video, but it's common sense. <laughs> but, yeah, let me know if y'all have any questions. Everything's going to be down below. Where to purchase the hair, the, the price, like, everything's going to be down below. I don't have pros and cons about this video. The pros outweigh the con. It's fire hair. Like, I'm not lying. I don't have to lie for nobody. You need hair. Fire. But yeah, guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this hair. 
I hope you guys like everything. You know, more videos will be posted soon. Shout out to Uni's hair. And that's about it. Bye, guys.